Hello, I'm Tom from New Art Club and uh, I've been asked to give you my top 10 tips for making successful comedy dance. And here are the first five. Number one, context is everything. If you see two men dancing around doing a kind of Polish folk dance to silly Eastern European polka music, that's not particularly funny. But when you know that that dance is called The Girl with the Shitty Shoe, it takes on a comedic edge. Number three, try to make a dance that at least has the possibility of seeping into the public consciousness. David Brent's funny dance in the office, everybody knows it. I've been making dances for about 20 years no one knows a single one of them. They don't even know Garden Gnome Sex Attack, and that is good. Number three. If you're going to go to Australia to perform a comedy dance, make that comedy, dan comedy dance's reference material be Australians, because they love material about themselves. Yes, you do, don't you? And number five, or four, or six, or wherever we are, if you're going to perform a comedy dance to a comedy audience, assume that that comedy audience wants to laugh. They'll just laugh. If you're going to perform a comedy dance to a dance audience, assume that they think they're not supposed to laugh. Number four or five, I can't remember where I am. If you're going to be part of a double act making comedy dances, make sure there's two of you. He's busy. He couldn't make it. He said, you do the film, Tom. You do the film. You'll be fine. And that's the top five. That's the first five. Not in any order. And um, I'm going to be back tomorrow to tell you some more. Bye. Goodbye. Is that the kind of thing? Exactly the kind of thing.